Rápido. Okay. So we found Cody. Hale. Bro. Hale. Bro, bro, bro. Oh my Dude, god. That was crazy. Our bags are packed. Our Uber's outside. We're going on like a three or four day Mexican road trip. I've never even left uh, Mexico City, so I don't even know what to expect. I've never done research on this place. I don't even know what exactly we're doing. <laughs> In Mexico, there's two kinds of highways. The free highway and the, I guess, the paid highway. The paid highway, though, costs, if not more money here than in America. I swear to God. I, I, it's, uh, well, our first toll was four bucks. Yeah, it was like three bucks and four bucks. And we only three, went like, two, uh, yeah, like maybe 50 miles. Yeah, less than 50 maybe. Like 30, 30 miles or something. Paid like eight bucks already. Kind of crazy. I didn't expect that. Our first stop here is at a, a temple called Tula. So the people of this temple worship a serpent god called Quetzalcoatl. Um, he, had a he had feathers and everything all over him. It's actually pretty cool. This would be sick from a drone. Damn. Yeah, I was staring at this thing the whole time. I didn't even know this. it was actually a snake. And the, the cactus was its eyes. I'm guessing this would be Quetzalcoatl. Yo, look at these, dude. There's a whole bunch of bees inside this cactus. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Yo, <laughs> yo. <laughs> We're working our way there, but right now I stopping at all these little stores. We have some cool stuff here. Those are epic. That set right there. I might buy some of these when I go home. Put it into my room. Every uh, country I go to, I always buy at least one thing and I put it inside this box, like a memory box. And I just have something from every country and I love it. Check this out. This was used to sacrifice people. You hold it and you just stab people. <laughs> This too, like, so you hold it like this, and it's a hand knife, and you use it to, uh, to cut um, like pieces of people. It's pretty cool, I've never been to one in Mexico. Yeah, I've never even seen an Aztec temple. Apparently this place was covered in jade and gemstones, and it was beautiful, and it was for the uh, temple for the god Quetzalcoatl. Okay, the slow motion, man, it may look epic, but it's all fake. It's really hard to get up here. <laughs> I can see everything up here. It's so cool. But I gotta show you these warriors right here. These bad boys. Look at them. Because it's, it's just so unique. You come up to the top of this Aztec pyramid and then you just see a whole bunch of these totems and stuff. I'm, I've never seen anything like this. This is like something new to me. I've been traveling for quite some time now, but never seen stuff like this. Oh, what? Check behind them. Look at their symbols. We're all walking through all these. Wow, it's weird over there. Check how green the grass is out of nowhere, random. It's like luscious green. Yo, that worked out so good. You're my cinematic. Reading uh, this little sign right here. These are supposed to show um, rattlesnakes devouring humans. Oh yeah, they can see here. You can see like the snake eye, the mouth is like uh, L shape and here's the skeleton being sucked into the rattlesnake's mouth. Damn. <laughs> just left the temple and now we're heading to the cement factory that people has been recommending us to go to. We don't know anything about it. We don't know if we can even go in there. We don't even know if it's going to be even worth to see. We found the cement factory and right now we're going to try to see if we can get in. There's tons of dogs though. I'd be scared to get in there without permission. Alright, let's see what happens. I'm going to put this cam out for a bit. I've never seen so many dogs in my life. Dude, that's what we were just saying. <laughs> As we got rejected, we drove another two and a half hours through valleys. And let me tell you, these valleys wasn't like no desert. I was when I think of Mexico, I think of like a lot of deserts and some great spicy food. I, it's it, you know typical. I love it, um, but I was not expecting to drive through some of the most amazing green 
valleys I've ever seen in my life. I, honestly, like, I can't believe it. And I ended up in this small town. It might be one of the most beautiful towns I've ever seen in my life. Honestly, no, no joke. I gotta, I gotta get the name of this place. But... Wait, Mike, Mike, what's this town called? Sla Slal Puhawa. Slal Puhawa? Slal, Slal Puhawa. Pueblo Magico, which is uh, called a magic town here in Mexico. There's, I don't know, a lot of them across the country, but basically most of them are small towns. Really nice, beautiful squares, nice cobblestone streets, and usually a nice church in the middle. So here we are now. through all these mini alleyways with the stone roads. I I really love this place. Yeah. Dude, I don't even know what this is, but I'm going up there. I never pictured myself coming to Mexico until I met Mike. And he like pretty much was, he had so much abandoned places he wanted to take me to the first time I came to Mexico, so I did it. Um, and then I, I realized how amazing Mexico was. and. So this is my second time here. I never thought I'd be driving through the canyons and through the mountains or even on the highway, going to different states. By the way, did you know Mexico has states like the United States? I never knew that. Just look at where we are. Here's another church on the side of it. I'm just gonna walk in really quick, see what it looks like. Yeah, I'm just gonna walk out. Everyone's looking at me. <laughs> the whole table just stopped and looked at me. Oh. <laughs> Yo. Cool. This is so cool. Man, I could just take like a, a week break, kind of just kick it here and just think about life. Write some poetry. Yeah, yeah. for real. Then to oh, you use the bathroom? Oh, the bathroom. They spent probably so much money on this high tech gate. But it's just to stop people from using the bathroom for free. <laughs> we lost Cody. Cody split it from us as we were uh, getting the hotel and talking to the locals and Mike ringing the bell. And he says that he's at like this like big open room in like a festival area. And he's just chilling with a whole bunch of people, eating, laughing. Basically, we get, a, we get a Facebook message from him saying like, guys, if you're worried, I'm not lost, but uh, I'm in a house with a bunch of people. They're all laughing and playing games, and they invited us all to dinner. So <laughs> <laughs> we're trying to figure out where he is so we can go join. Yeah. What's up, man? What up, guys? So Co Cody's a local now. Okay. Mis amigos, uh, as Mike Miguel, Mi gusto, Miguel. de Canada, and as uh, Josh. And uh, so I saw the fireworks in the sky, so I came walking over here, and I saw them, and I was looking for them, but I couldn't find them, and then Juan shows up. Yeah. Juan shows up, and he, he's like, he speaks English, which is great. So <laughs> it helped me out, and I was like, I was like, I'm looking for the fireworks, do you know where they are? And he's like, yes, my nephew, he's doing them right there. So I went up there, and I was like, oh my god, this is amazing. I jumped up on the wall, I filmed some fireworks, and then he's like, he's like, this is a, a festival that's going on. And the festival is for nine days at one house, and then it moves to the next house. And they do that for two months. And it's kind of all around. So they invited me in, they were singing songs uh, for, to the Virgin of Mexico City. Yeah. The Virgin of Mexico City. And uh, we had tostadas. <laughs> and coca-cola and i spilled my coca-cola <laughs> and uh and then it came out here we've been taking pictures i showed them my youtube channel and uh i added a bunch of people on facebook and uh, then like 20 minutes ago i got to go light the fireworks myself oh okay. so yeah and then now we're here taking group pictures and then you showed up <laughs> meanwhile, meanwhile there you have it we're about to light off a firework <laughs> Joshua, 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 Joshua,
I'm running again though. Run! Aguas! Aguas! Thank you so much, Juan. <laughs> you have shown me such a fun night. Yes, thank you, thank it's you. It's seriously probably one of the best nights I've had in a very long time. Good. So thank you so much for having us. And we're going to see you bright and early in the morning. Tomorrow morning. Yes, thank you so much. See you guys tomorrow. See you tomorrow, man. He has a bakery and we're going to be eating night. good tomorrow morning. <laughs> Dude, they were honestly super nice. It was amazing. I'm going to end the video here in the dark. Peace out. You guys got to watch tomorrow's video when I actually live it up. You got to see the experience all about it. Mexico is amazing. And I'm out. <laughs>